Someone tried to scam Engineer Man this morning, and I'm not about to let him get away with it. Let's show him who's boss. So I got a super legit text message this morning that looks a little bit like this. Craigslist.potsfam.com. Well, that sounds like the Craigslist URL. Let's go ahead and have a look at this URL and see what we're working with. So we got a login page and it's a uh, total BS, as far as I can tell. So what's the worst possible thing I could do to him right now? Well, I could just send him a bunch of fake emails and passwords over and over. So let's just go ahead and do that. So to do that, I'll put my login box up here, grab my trusty Chrome console, click preserve log, throw an email and password in here, click login, and then analyze which one it sent it to. So that looks like it. Form data, email and password, sent to this crazy weird URL, and then it looks like it's redirecting to Craigslist phone verification. So I definitely have the right call. So we'll go ahead and use that URL for the rest of this video. So we'll go ahead and copy these things into my code. I know I need this request URL. Just make a note there. And I know I need these two pieces of data. And that should be it for Chrome Console. You can just close all that out. Next, I'm going to be sending fake names. I'm going to need a names list. So just go ahead and just hit up the internets for that. Top thousand baby boy names. Sure, that'll work. Yeah, that'll work. Perfect. So I'll just select all these. Great. Let's copy those. We'll make a JSON file. Do you like names.json? Go ahead and paste all those in there. Get rid of this garbage. And then we'll just use a little regex magic to basically take all these names and convert it into a to an array. Oh, look at that, magic. Come to the top here and add the opening bracket. Go all the way to the bottom and add the closing bracket. And that's it for the names. We're good, we're good there. Okay, time to start building the code. I know I'm gonna need a few things. I know I'm gonna need request. I know I'm gonna need OS. I know I'm gonna need random. I know I'm gonna need string. I know I'm gonna need JSON. I'll need a character list and a random seed. I have this URL that I'll be sending requests to, so I'll put that into a URL variable. So next I need to open and parse the name, so name equals json.loads, open names.json, and then read. And I can start my loop for name and names. So I have the name, but I also need like name extra. And I need that because I need a few extra digits on the end just to you know, make the thing seem like it's more of an email. So this will just add a few digits to the end of that. I'll then do the username, which will be the lowercase name, plus the name extra, plus then I'm just going to do like at yahoo.com, which should be fine. Password will be similar to the name extra. I will just join a random choice of characters. And we'll just do like eight of those. That should be fine. Last is to set up the actual call to the server. So we'll use request.post, send it to the URL. Allow redirects will be false. That'll prevent us from going to the Craigslist page after. And then the data is going to be basically this here. Because we saw that these are the two fields that he is sending. Send the username to the first, password to the second. Let's give it a try to make sure everything's working so far. Yep, it's not outputting anything, but we'll make it output some stuff. So we can add some output to see what it's doing. So print like sending username and password. And then we'll put username and password in there. Go ahead and run it again and watch as it works. 
So right now it's sending all these emails and passwords to his form. And hopefully what this will do is it'll confuse his system into thinking that these are legit and he'll have a hard time distinguishing between the legitimate ones and the fake ones. And we're done. I can't stand scammers, so I thought this would be a fun way to both waste this guy's time and show you something cool in Python. So if you liked the video, let me know in the comments. See you next video.